Oh, time to go play cards with Gil. Let's do these ones first, actually, since we're here. I thought I understood what meant to come here. Aha, the crisis in hydroponics. Look horrifying. Dutch will love them. All right, Gil. Let's play cards. So, Ryder, big news. I think I found my purpose. Card hustling? Life. Oh, yeah? What's that? Uh, thrashing you at poker? Shall I deal? Ryder, I can read Gil's vital signs and give you an advantage during the game if you like. No, let's play it straight. Don't. Alright, you can deal first. Having fun? Getting my ass kicked <laughs> is what I'm doing. Poker's lost me several friends over the years. The only one who still plays me is my buddy Jill. I, I know, I know, Jill and Gil. The one you mentioned. Uh, part of the initiative? Yep. Been awake since the start. Jill's a fertility expert. Heads the initiative CRC. My only real friend from back home. I bet 50. I call. The CRC? Colonial Repopulation Committee. She's always teasing that I'm making her job harder. Says if I'm not making babies, I'm part of the problem. We have that kind of relationship. <laughs> uh. Growing our numbers is paramount to our survival here. Sure. But that's Jill's purpose. I'm not just going to adopt it. See what I did there? I'm not just oh. going to adopt oh. it. I saw. You should meet her. You'll see. She's amazing. Another hundred. Ah, I fold. Another one for me then. Well, that's that. You win. I've achieved my true purpose in life. What will I do now? I'll get you next time, get it. Revenge will be mine. <laughs> Someday, maybe. Jill predicted you'd be my downfall. Can't wait to tell her she was wrong. Another streak intact, I'll say. Ouch. Have fun. And thanks for the game. I got the bond a little bit. Yeah, I'm not gonna. Ch I'm not gonna cheat at poker using uh. Damn, that that'd be mean. Plants have adapted to the scourge's presence. Some even feed on its radiant energy. Right. See this old specimens, scans. Our conservation effort can barely keep up. What a wonderful service you've done for us. You've certainly earned your fee. Thank you. Wow, six skill points. Nice.
Hey, you can max this out. All right. Right. Let's do the slightly reduced damage resistance, but we'll, we'll increase damage resistance, though slightly less, but with the speeding up uh, shield regeneration. uprising as security tightens across all sectors on the Nexus. Director Tan stresses that it's, quote, for your safety. This is h and Hmm. All right. Have you ever been trapped with nothing but your own thoughts to keep you company? It's excruciating. I do not experience psychological distress, as you describe it. Do you experience any emotions? No, and I am intrigued as to why you do. You find me intriguing? <laughs> uh... Ryder, one of your father's memories is available. Let's see it. This memory is of a family gathering on Earth. Finally, the Ryder clan in one room. It feels like it's been years since we were together. Or more. Well, I'll take whatever I can get. I've missed you two. How are you feeling, Mom? No, we're not doing that. There's only one rule for this visit. No talking about me. I'm fine. And when I'm not, the pills help. Deal? Okay. Good. Let's talk about something else. Alec? Um... Really? Well, uh, you're both looking... taller. Yeah, Dad, that does tend to happen. Right, right, I know. So, um... I heard the Alliance has a new Mako in the works. Yeah, word is they can airdrop this one from a ship. I know. They're saying we might get one on our next expedition. You still poking around the attic in Traverse? It's amazing. We think we might have found a Prothean site. No artifacts yet, but we're still digging. Ah, uh, I remember the day they found the first ruins on Mars. Changed my life. We knew for sure that aliens were real. We just had to go find them. Yes, every day I wake up, I'm looking at a Mass Effect relay, and I keep thinking, what's on the other side? Don't lose that. The minute you stop wondering what's beyond the mountain, you die a little inside. No chance of that. It's in our blood. You infected us. That was a weird smile they had. Maybe what was there. it like, Dad? When you went through that first relay? <laughs> Don't believe the stories. The Garon relay scared the shit out of us. Admiral Grissom included. Why don't we go have this dinner your mom's been slaving over all day? I'll tell you all about it.
I remember that. Mom complained the Ryder clan was never in the same room at the same time. Odd, considering you were family. <sighs> Life is crazy. People get busy. Scott and I were trying to start our lives. A course that seems to have been influenced by your father. Yeah, good or bad, your parents were buff on you. A form of symbiosis? Sure, I suppose. Though not always beneficial. It gave rise to you. Jerry's still out on that. Nevertheless, the emotional bonds among family became clear to me that day. Your progress as Pathfinder has unlocked an additional right, memory. Let's hear it. We'll see it. Let's see it. This memory is when Alec first learned the initiative. It will be just a moment. Hello, Alec. I'm too old for Cloak and Dagger. I got your message. I'm here. Who are you? A benefactor, if you like. You have something to offer me? A future. That's vague. A future for your wife. You're out of money. Your contacts have dried up. You can't finish, Sam. How do you know about... I can help you. Whatever you need. Start by telling me what you need. Your AI is more than a cure for your wife. It could also be the salvation for many others. I don't follow. Where we're going, we'll need a different perspective to understand things. Where's that? The Andromeda Galaxy? I have a proposal for you. And Ellen doesn't have much time. Are you interested? Ah. Uh. Who was that? The benefactor. I believe there was more to the Andromeda Initiative than was publicly understood. Private logs are now available in your father's quarters. They may shed further light on the matter. I detect additional memories, but they are currently locked. They may yet hold answers. Okay, I'll keep working on it. That's all for now. Of course. My liberator. Welcome. Thanks for your time. It would seem that is all I have to give, for now. Got two new logs. Your father's personal logs. I had a strange meeting yesterday. I thought it would be with Jien Garson who founded the initiative, but it wasn't. I guess Jien's the visionary, the one who gets everyone excited about the project and drums up publicity. But then this benefactor apparently provides resources and money. And I mean a lot of money. It's a little unusual. But everything about this project is. Interesting. I wonder if Director Tan knows anything about this. Worth talking to him. I wonder if this benefactor is the elusive man. I accepted the initiative's offer. They're calling me a Pathfinder. <laughs> There's no other option left. Same will never happen without their help. Our savings are gone, and no one will return my calls. I am a pariah. There's something strange going on with this benefactor. But... Ellen's getting worse. I can't fail her. That log is not currently accessible. Unlocking my memory array may enable it. Alright. I am, like, seriously willing to bet... Seriously, we can bet that the benefactor is, in fact, actually, um, the elusive man. 
find the uh, cryo bag. Just That was a hell of a thing talking to your brother in a coma. Can't say I really bought into the whole Sam implant, but well, that was pretty amazing. Yeah, it was. I had no idea we could do that. Just when you think you've seen it all. And here, a 600 year trip to a new galaxy seemed like science fiction. Something new every day. That's all, Harry. Thanks. I'll be here if you need me. Let's talk to Director Tan, see if this benefactor is. I'm willing to bet it's the elusive man, but I could be wrong. I'm sorry, Lana. They're just trying to boost our morale. Pathfinder, maybe you can clear this up. How can I help? My friend Jory was on EOS the first go-round, barely survived. Now they want him to go back. They're saying the conditions are improved, that that it's safe now, is it? Yeah, I just, it's like above 100% habitability. You can believe the reports. EOS is becoming a livable and sustainable space. Going back to reclaim it will help heal your scars. See, Jory? It's going to be okay. Thank you, Pathfinder. Uh, I'll do that. Yeah, I've gotten the place up to 100% my ability. I've taken out the Ket base, stabilized the vault. Hello again. Hey, Tan, I got a question for you. Be great to see all your hard work on display. Yeah. The whole mood of the Nexus has changed since Eos. You really can feel it. New outpost, a Pathfinder's help, people waking up. It's a fresh start. Third time's a charm. 
If you happen to have a Pathfinder around. Can't always rely on luck. From here, it's hard work. But it's damn good to know we're on the right track. Huh. Wiggins, Rosetta Ass Probe. Venus Express. Also Wiggins, Rosetta. Mars. Pippi Columbo and Juice. Pippi Columbo and Juice being ones that are clearly in the future. Exo Mars. That would have been in process when the game was had just come out. You've had a year to think about it. It's the scourge, Director Tan. Its origin defies all known explanation. How? We've brought all that equipment along. And the Tempest's readings are helping, but we've just scratched the surface. The history of the initiative cannot show that we were defeated by a space cloud. Some things are bigger than we are. I will not accept that excuse. This is science, and your merry band over there are scientists, aren't they? Figure it out. Goodbye, Director. Ah, uh, you're a dick. Apex. Congratulations are in order. Peaceful contact with the Angara. It's everything the initiative stands for. It was amazing. A culture we'd never met before, in a brand new galaxy. I was just glad to be part of it. It's a moment to savor. In the Milky Way, first contact was a rare event. In the meantime, I am you eager to force diplomatic ties with the Incarn people. I. We need any allies we can get. Did you have some other business? I'm curious. What do you know about the people who backed the initiative? What everyone knows. Gian Carson was the founder and visionary. Unfortunately, she died on the Nexus during the Scourge disaster. Is there anyone else? I would almost welcome them. A voice to silence the rabble. Then Cash might listen. But no, we're alone. Why do you ask? Do I want to spill the beans? Or do I want to play it coy? Alec encrypted those memories for a reason. Not just because, oh, he wanted... To share something to share with me and for the writer siblings. But on the other hand. My background of listening to art, to reading old detective stories does that if you push the issue, eventually some no neck, somebody with no neck and little yeah, no neck will come and try to ask you to stop qu asking questions, which will lead you in the right direction. I have information that suggests Garson wasn't the only one. What sort of information? It's complicated, but there was a silent partner, a benefactor. Even if that were true, we've been here 14 months with no sign of them. This partner is either a phantom, missing, or dead. No, Gian Garson was the beacon. A sad end to someone of such stature. Dying alone. Oh? It was chaos. By the time they found her, she was already dead, succumbed to her injuries. Was there a follow-up investigation? I wasn't even out of stasis. But knowing the violence of the Scourge disaster, death was everywhere. If you're suggesting something else happened, Ryder, I'd rather you didn't. Let's not add to the confusion. Thank you for your time. Ryder, if you wish to pursue this further, accessing Nexus security records may reveal Oh, I absolutely want to pursue this further. An expedition to when someone tells the detective to stop investigating, that means you keep investigating.
Okay, what are we looking for, Sam? Any information relating to Jean Carson's death. Huh. The only hard fact is that her body was found in one of the apartments. Then connecting her death to the Scourge disaster was mere speculation. Yeah. Oh, they just wanted this to go away. I think we need to check out that apartment. Environmental data will allow us to reconstruct the scene. Oh, I love me a, murder, a science fiction murder mystery. They're the best. I... All murder mysteries are great, but I love science fiction ones because you get to do really neat stuff. A violent illness related to cherry-like fruit brought back from Habitat 7 has authorities baffled. Multiple passengers are still in quarantine. This is HNS. Stairs. So glad I went to school for this. Thanks for not being bigger. A bar opens on the Nexus. Visitors herald the vortex as a sign of civility and the opposite of civility. This is where Jean Garson's body was discovered. What are we looking for? If you scan the room, environmental data may allow for scene recreation. There. This was no accident. She was murdered. As this incident occurred over a year ago, her killer is likely far away by now. Yeah. But... Wait. This whole area was shuttered back then. Didn't open till the Hyperion arrived. So what was Garson even doing here? Perhaps a further scan of the room is in order. Hello? What do we have here? Garson, I don't have much time. I've been hiding in the sealed off sections of the Nexus since we got here. Someone's trying to kill me. And now I can hear them down in the hydroponics area. They're coming. I've embedded what I know in my VI in the cultural center. This log has the code. And whatever happens... Oh god, they're outside the door. Wow, this is some serious shit. Yes, deeply troubling. I have the code she mentioned for the VI kiosk. So here's my guess. Elusive man or someone else in um, Cerberus set this up as insurance policy in case things don't go out where God has planned with the Reapers. Um, I originally thought this was actually a council project un under the uh, radar council project. And that... Um, then, yeah, and then things, or whatever. Yeah, like, the, the, the council project, this could be Cerberus as an insurance policy in case their plan didn't work out. I'm Jean Garson, founder of the initiative. On behalf Hello there, neighbor. I'm Jean Garson, the founder of the initiative. 
founder of the Andromeda Initiative. I thought you might like to hear more about our plans. We hope you'll enjoy learning about the rich diversity... Sam, can we hear that message Garson talked about? Unlocking it now. Rerouting to our private channel. For years, there was a silent partner involved with the initiative. The truth is, I was running out of money. Then a benefactor stepped in. I didn't ask questions. I never met them face to face. That was a mistake. I lied to everyone. Something big spooked them in the Milky Way, and now they're moving a hundred thousand of us to Andromeda. I hope it's all for the good, but I have my doubts. And now I think they're going to remove me. Alec Ryder and I had a code word for this. Fulcrum. He may have learned more. What's that mean, something big in the Milky Way? Perhaps your father's locked memories hold the answer. He might have known more. Yeah? Guess I'll have to keep unlocking them to find out for sure. Oh, hey. Hey, Joel. Pathfinder, thank you for arranging my access to the Cultural Center. Mm, there's so much to study here. <laughs> ah, it would take a lifetime. I'd enjoy that. All the reading. History, science, culture. Get some snacks, settle into that corner over there. No offense, but I'm starting with the Asari. Oh, sure. But when you get to Elcor Hamlet, I want to know. <laughs> <laughs> oh, right. Well, it's on hold for now, so, um...